What's up guys, Skittle Ramp H here. So today we're gonna head out and go Funko Pop hunting and we're gonna answer the question that is, what Funko Pops are at discount stores like Ross, Marshalls, and Five Below? So let's go Funko Pop hunting and see what we can find. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I do hope you're having a great day. So we are outside the first store currently, uh, which is Ross, and we're gonna be going inside and just seeing what kind of pops you can find at discount stores. Just a little fun idea I kind of thought of. I, like I've been seeing so many pops just pop up, no pun intended, at all these discount stores all over the country. So I figured I would see what does Florida have in some of the stores that I never really ever go to. So let's go ahead and head inside and let's see what we can find. And as I said, guys, Ross is our first stop. So let's go inside. Okay, so I found their little toy section here and all the little discount stuff. So let's see if we can find anything in here. Kind of just take you guys with me. So we have some X shot, a bunch of Hot Wheels here, Ninja Turtles. Uh, Volkswagen, that's pretty cool. Um, some Barbie stuff, Punching Kid. Okay, so I found a shelf and we have Edgin here so far from Dungeons and Dragons. And this one costs five bucks. That's actually not bad. Now another one we have is Electro, which is also five bucks. If it was the Glow Tea Bundle, I would pick it up. I do prefer the Glow over the regular, but it's still a pretty neat find. And then we also had a Steph Curry cover here for nine bucks from $21. That is not bad. And I think the last Funko Pop over here is this Zombie Iron Man, a pretty decent find. Okay, so they had another shelf back here with lots of stuff and I am seeing a lot of Funko Pops, but one that caught my eye was this Sasuke here. Oh my gosh. Now right here we have some decent finds like Megami from Jujutsu Kaisen, Boy Band Stan, as well as Shen from Dragon Ball Super. And over here we had Holga as well as Circus Freddy. That's definitely a pretty cool one. I don't really care for the look of these ones, so I'm passing on these FNAF pops. I won't lie, probably my best find so far, which is a Venom pop. And again, only five bucks. So I guess all their pops are five bucks, but not, not bad. I like this one. And then we also have another Sasuke, not the glow and Edgin as well. I think that is about it. I don't know, I'm gonna call it. I think Venom and probably the Circus Freddy are our best finds. Oh, and just in case anybody was curious, they do actually also sell like little figures here for other anime. So only 15 bucks, which is not bad. Normally something like this would be 20 to 25 at like box lunch. They also have Q-Pot skits for 15. We have a Tomura figure here, Bakugo back there. And then they even have a cool Tengen figure also for 15. These are really, really good prices for these figures. I'm not gonna lie guys, I might have to check Ross more often for one Funko Pops, but two other like little statues and figures because there was a really decent selection. Okay, so now we might be headed to another Ross or we might hit up a Marshalls to see if they have anything. All right guys, so we're currently in Marshalls and I came across a table and I'm already seeing a Funko Pop. So we do have the Jeff Gordon driving Rainbow Warrior Pop ride and this one is, I'm not seeing a price. The price was on the bottom and it's $12.99. That's not too bad for this pop ride. Okay, so there weren't any more pops on the table, but let's check over here. I'm actually already seeing a Santa. Let's just head over there. All right, I found Coca-Cola Santa. This is a neat find just in time for the holidays, actually. And it looks like here their pops are $6 instead of 5 Honestly, I was not expecting to find Naruto Monopoly sealed here. This one's only 20 bucks here. Normally it's like 40 bucks, so this is a great deal. So guys, I did look for another couple minutes and they in fact did not have any more pops. So their selection wasn't the greatest. I would say maybe the, the Santa Claus was the best find there, but it is cool to see that they do in fact have pops there. So. They also do have a Five Below, which is right over there. We're going to head over there and see if they have anything. All right, guys, here we are, Five Below. Last time they didn't have any Funko Pops, I was here, but let's check if they have anything Funko at all. Okay, so in Five Below, in the front here, I am noticing they do have some Funko FNAF figures like Tie-Dye Foxy, as well as Tie-Dye Chica, and Tie-Dye Freddy here. It does look like this time, guys, they do, in fact, have a lot of Funko items. So up here are some of their Funko mini items like Infinity Saga, Harry Potter, Jurassic World, and My Hero Academia, as well as we did have the office here mickey and friends and lilo and stitch oh and some princesses and it also looks like they got in a bunch of gold figures now right here are various different funko keychains like hocus pocus naruto and guardians of the galaxy and right here we had a couple more funko minis as well as the spot their five below exclusive so for pops i'm noticing they got in a lot of edwards and doctor strange's and both of these have chases so let's look around for maybe a chase so guys i was checking all of these doctor strange's and we in fact came across two chases here 
here. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. And keep in mind, guys, they're only $6 here. Guys, I can't make this up. I, in fact, found three total chases here. This is like some of the best luck I've ever had. And what I'm gonna do, actually, is pick up one of these chases, and I'm gonna give it away at the end of this video, so make sure to stay tuned. Now, as far as the rest of their Funko Pops, they did get in some BTS as well as Circus Foxy, and they got in Hunter Hunter's Bisky, Yuji Itadori, and some Cuphead Pops. All right, guys, so I didn't realize they also have TJ Maxx in this parking lot, and I think they get in Funko Pops too, so let's just check just in case. You know, guys, I looked all over and I was about to give up, and then for some reason, there's Funko Pops next to the grooming kits. So we do have a Bono with... I, I can't even pronounce that, but it's a pop ride. And over here, we do have Grogu using the Force, as well as Ramus Lupin with the Shrieking Shack. Not terrible finds. Okay, so let's recap what we've found so far. We did find a chase, a couple chases actually, was not expecting to find that. And then on top of that, we also found pop rides, we found, I think, a six inch pop, some deluxes, and then regular four inch pops. And not bad selections at some of these stores. All right guys, so I decided to take the chance and just drive over to this other Ross that was like 10 minutes down the road. And as a matter of fact, I am seeing a five below in this same plaza. So two for two on both of these stores. So let's hope they have some good stuff. All right guys, so this toy section is much bigger, but honestly, it is just like all over the place. I'm fighting the urge to like organize it. I'm not gonna lie. But I don't know if we're going to find anything in here. Though some of the cool things I did find was this multiverse figure static shock. And then I also found some of the vibration stars. We have Anbu Itachi and then we also do have some MHA. So I did look for a little bit, but I wasn't seeing anything that remotely looked like a Funko Pop. So probably nothing over there today, but they did have lots of other stuff. And just like that, guys, here we are. Let's see what they have. So I found a Funko sign and they have lots of stuff over here. So for starters, they do actually have some of these single bitty pops here. So this is a pretty cool find. And for little minis, they do have Balloon Bonnie here and a bunch of other ones. Oh, they even have Usopp. Now right here, they have Thanos as well as their Spider-Woman exclusive. And they even have a bunch of Pocket Pop keychains. Chains. They do have another exclusive mini, which is Wanda Maximoff. We also have some Harry Potter here and Stranger Things. And down here, they have Captain Carter, some Lightyear, and Ghostbusters Afterlife Pops. Further down, they do have Sprite, as well as some BTS, more Lightyear, and a Circus Foxy. And all the way at the bottom, they have a couple Funko Gold figures and some of the Disney Princess minis. So guys, we are now back in the studio and definitely a fun hunt today. Obviously, the big winner here was finding three chases at five below of the Doctor Strange pop. It would have been really nice to find the Edward Elric, though, but I already have that one, so it's really not a big loss. But yeah, I feel like we found some decent stuff at the other stores, but five below was definitely the winner here. And I'm curious, have you guys found anything at discount stores, and what was your best find? Let me know in the comments below. But now that we've answered the question of the video as to what you can find at discount stores, now let's go over our little giveaway. So I in fact did buy a Doctor Strange chase to give away to you guys in this video for fun. And all you have to do is comment below your favorite movie as well as in that comment, put your Instagram so I can reach you just in case you don't reach me. And lastly, just leave a like on the video and you're entered and I'll pick a winner in a couple of days. Well guys, I don't wanna take up any more of your time today. Thank you so much for watching this video. Smash that like button down below with your big toe if you did enjoy and subscribe and click that notification bell if you are new here. I do wanna say a big shout out to all the awesome Patreon supporters on the channel. You guys rock for supporting myself and the channel. If you guys are interested and wanna check out the Patreon, the link is down below. We have a Patreon only Discord where we share a lot of information, news, stocks, updates, links, and more. And lastly, make sure to follow me on all my social medias at Skittle Rampage over on Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, and my Facebook page so you can stay up to date. All right, love you guys. See you guys in the next one. See you guys later. Bye.